Hey guys, um, I've been listening to a lot of student videos this week. We've had a lot of online lessons and I thought it was kind of my turn to do something. So here you go. This is just a simple long tone exercise. I've been doing this since I was a teenager. I got it from my old teacher, Joan Watson, who got it from her old teacher, Dick Ely, who used to be the professor of horn at the University of Victoria. And he studied with Chris Luba and goodness knows who else. And there's, there's nice lineage to it. So um, it's a simple long tone exercise. Anybody can do it. You can modify it for the notes you know. It does involve a half step, so knowing your chromatic scale is super important. And all we're going to do is set a steady tempo. You can listen for the first bit and join in. I'm going to start on the G above middle C, horn G, concert C. Um, and it just involves four quarter notes, a half note slur, and that goes down a half step and then comes back. Then there's a little rest, and then we check it again with the note that we began the whole exercise on. You'll see what I mean? I'll count us in. Here we go. One, two, three. <laughs> thumbs up I hope so now I'm gonna go back to the G that we started on and I'm gonna take that G and go down normally I go a little bit higher than I just went I, I usually go to the F instead of the D and then when I go down I start on the same G and I go at least two octaves down but again this is an exercise that you can modify however you want for your range so it's great for beginners it's great for intermediate students it's great for advanced players it really works for everybody I like it because I get a little bored with the whole note long tones. And I know you're not really supposed to say that aloud. It's like a horn heresy, but this keeps my mind active and engaged. And yeah, it's just, it's been a really comforting thing to have over the years. So here we go. I'm going to go from G down to G below middle C and feel free to play along. One, two, three. <laughs> 